How's it going ladies and bruises? I'm Bobby Six and welcome back to Yonder. Now we're back in the snowy area because we are looking for the master constructor. So we're heading up, but I started a little bit early because I realized we could open this. So we can open this on camera first. Now off the record I did actually create a tree plot for one of my farms because I had the materials to do so, so I did. Kitty! I also heard I also found a kitty and heard another one, but I couldn't find the other one that I heard, unfortunately. But, we were just heading our way back up here to look for the Master Constructor for the main mission, I believe. When I came across that and realised that we could open it, so we should probably do that. So that everybody knows what's going on. Not that it was a huge deal, but you know, you know for the sake of continuity and all that. Alright, let's head on up. We haven't got very far to go, I don't think, any way to get up there. We got some seeds, which is nice. We can plant one or two trees before we uh, run out of the ability to plant trees, I guess. Let's plant one here. Boom. 23 more to go. Well, yeah, that's not going to happen. But thanks for the vote of confidence there, game. Like it's ever going to happen. Can we do this? We can! Amazing what one more sprite will do for you. Amazing. Let's check this out then. Creepy. Creepy cave. Creepy, scary, doom cave. Kitty! Boom. Why does that lady have 53 cats? That's fucking ridiculous. Right, let's bust these up. You never know what we're gonna get. Because barrels are like a box of chocolates. Occasionally you get seeds out of them, which make life a little bit easier for you. Nope. Alright. Well, that's pretty good. Oh, we got some actual seeds, but... For garden plots. I wanted to make a garden plot, not a tree plot, but they were way harder to make, so I made a tree plot instead. Because I'm not into effort. Effort sucks. I hate... things that are hard. That's not true. <laughs> Half the games we play on here are extremely hard, and the other half are extremely easy. Or at least, what would be considered extremely casual. Casual's fun. Alright, now if we're lucky, we can get this done while we're up here, and then we're going to just jump off, and we're going to head to this new area to the north here. That's the plan. We're just going to leap off the cliff and head north. And get to that new area, hopefully, once we've found the Master Constructor. That's that's the plan. That is the plan. What is happening? Is it a full-on storm? I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to you. Okay. You mean to repair the heart of the Cloud Catcher? I might just be the only person alive who can help. My grandma built the original mechanism, you see. She passed the knowledge down to me. I can build the spare parts you'll need. Hmm. Oh, but first we need celestial ore. Ah. You'll find it in the Stark Caverns. It's a scary place we sealed up long ago. Ah. Take this key. It'll unseal the door to the caverns, and you can mine the celestial ore. I'll, uh, stand guard outside. Oh, okay. You're not filling me with confidence here. I'm a little bit nervous now. I don't want it to be scary. Oh my god, it sounds horrific. I don't like this place. Then this is going to turn into a horror game. I'm already nervous. Sounds like there's a cow down here. There's a cow. Hello. And a weird old man. Get back, foul ghost. You're not a ghost? Well, I can't take any chances. When that cloud catcher went bad, I was ready. I took Betsy and I hid, and hid away in here safe and sound. And we'd be happy if it weren't for the ghost making these horrible wailing sounds. Poor Betsy is so scared she moans all days long. I've never seen the ghost, but I know it's real. It keeps stealing Betsy's psyllium seed. Is that the ore? I guess I have to help Betsy first, right? Alright, I'll go have a look. Don't wait up. Okie dokie. 
What the fuck? Oh, is that a sprite? Of course it's a sprite. <laughs> Hello? Are you a ghost? No? You're just a regular human? I'm sorry for wailing and crying, but I'm so scared of the ghost. Can't you hear its terrible moaning? It's so loud and scary. I even tried stuffing my ears with the psyllium seed I find. Those scary noises are just a gruffle? Let me join you, you can have this glowing rock. I was using it to keep it, the ghost away, but I don't need it now. Yay! Oh, we need more ore. Well, that's a good start, we got one. Can I break this? Yeah! There's another one. Oh, it's a mining spot. Ah. Oh. I was hoping to get more out of it than that. Oh well. Man, I love breaking stuff. It's so good. Boom. Boom. This is fun. I like it down here. Terrifying, but fun. Hi! I jumped because I was so excited. So the ghost is just a sprite, but only you can see it, and you're taking it with you. Right, you surf as well as a rod. Forget it, I'm staying down here. Just take the stone and leave Betsy and me in peace. Okay, that's three. Can I break this one? Yeah, I can. Alright. We need two more. Must be this way. Or not. Might not be this way. Could quite possibly be another way. I'm gonna guess it's another way. Not that way. That way's a dead end. <laughs> that way I just walk into a wall and look stupid. Not that I need any help with that, yo. This way? Man, I love breaking walls. Walls are the best things to break. I see some. Boom. One more. One more. This is going pretty good. Cannot complain. Hmm, where's the last one though? Maybe there's more up here to break? Aha! There's a mushroom. Not exactly what I was after, but you know, I'm not going to complain. Maybe I'll complain a little bit. I'm going to complain a little bit, but not, not too much. Maybe too much. Probably too much, yeah. I'm going to complain a lot. Yeah, that didn't help. We're still missing one. Is it the exclamation mark point to it? Because that'd be helpful. I always push the button at the wrong time when I'm running past something. Just to grab it on the fly, you know? Ah. I see it. That was lucky I just looked up there. Just happened to look upwards. Nice. Let's go. Hey, this is good. That was good. That was fun. I enjoyed that. Where are you, lady? You weren't even guarding the door, you ass. I thought you were going to guard the door. I can't believe the ghost was just a gruffle. Although in our defense, old man Wilson is pretty scary. Thanks for bringing the Celestial War. It's time to make Grandma proud. Come back in three nights time, and I'll have the spare parts ready for you. Three nights? That's not good enough. I want it ready by tomorrow. By the morning. Have it ready by morning. Or else. Or else I'll sick my scary gruffle on you. Okay. Well. We know our plan. We're gonna head out and we're gonna jump north. If it'll let us. Just like jump off the edge of the cliff. If it'll let us do that, we, that's exactly what we're doing. And I assume that's uh, this one, Ingle Nook. Alright, here we go. Away! Oh, we are so majestic. We are a majestic eagle. Okay. I want to break this. Boom. Ha. Ah, yeah. That's what you get. So there's a 
a mercap here somewhere. Well, there's one. Is that the one I was looking at? We got 13 sprites now. That's pretty good. It's quite a lot of sprites. That means we can break that thing open in the desert again. Now, finally. Can we clear this? Oh yeah! Now we can clear heaps of these now. Treasure chest! One of my favourite things ever. Decorated egg. All of the merc has been cleared, great job. Way! What is a decorated egg for? Oh, it's just worth a fuckload of money? Oh, I see. So if I even need to buy something worth $1,016, we're good. Cool. Oh, that'd be handy, I guess. Problem is I'd have to buy $1,016 worth of shit at one go. Ah, barter system. You're both a blessing and a curse, but mainly a curse, actually. You're a curse. Fuck off. Alright, looks like there's a Zingle Nook over there. There's some Merc over there. We got a whole new area to explore. I'm pretty excited about this. Let's get into it. What are you? I don't know what you are. I see you, Angle Nook, but I'll be back. I see Merc. I want to explore around you before I explore in you. That sounds filthy. <laughs> That's disgusting. Alright. What do we got here? Can I clear you? Yes! I think it takes five? Jesus. Could have done that donkey's yonks ago. Donkey's yonks. Feel like we're making progress today. Holy shitballs. We're gonna do some more exploring before we head to town. Looks like there's a lot to explore around here. We're doing so well and yet our farms are doing nothing. I have three farms now, and only one of them has one animal on it, and the other two have nothing on them. One of them has an animal house, but no animal, and the other one has literally nothing. <laughs> so that's a good start, right? We should go back to the early areas and start busting out some of the um, merc there, because... Is this a turny thing? I feel like it might be. Where's the merc right here? Is it under me? Um, I feel like there's a bunch back there that we left behind that we could probably deal with now, I imagine. Because it's been so long. Oh, hello. Hello, what do we got here then? Nothing that we can be working with right now, by the look of it. And I assume that's where this other merc is, underneath there. Well, guess we're going to Inglenook. Inglenook. And speak with Adler Waxton. Adler. Adler Waxton. Yep, that's a name. Okie dokie, uh, can we go around that way? I want to go up there. There's a bunch of question marks up in here too. Bet there's another guild in here to join. I think we're missing one. The Brewers Guild. We haven't done the Brewers Guild yet. Maybe that'll be here. I'm assuming it's here. I feel like we've covered most of the map at this point actually. Kitty! Got you. Shivering plains. Well, I can understand that. It's fucking looking pretty damn cold. It's looking almost as cold as I feel right now. Man, I hate winter. Winter is the worst. Sitting here freezing my ass off playing this game. Alright. We go this way. We're going to Inglenook. And it looks like there's some question marks and some missions and some shit to do. Ah, oh, so much happening. Ooh, this town's cool. Holy balls, I like it. It reminds me of that one on Final Fantasy X. Can't remember what it's called. The one where the bear goes from. Whoever's... I've forgotten his name too. I hear you're looking for the path to Arcadia. That's strange. Arcadia is a special place for sprite seers. No one's traveled there for a long time. I've been hearing folks tell stories about a lone traveler who talks to sprites. Maybe they're talking about you. I was imagining someone older. If you're really a sprite seer, craft this special brew and take it to the pillar in front of our village. Pour the fiery bloom water into the pillar very carefully. Then you just have to follow the flames. They'll guide you to Arcadia. And be careful your eyebrows. They take a surprisingly long time to grow back. Great. Arcadian ice. 
Hello. Hello, Wanderer. Do you know to whom you speak? You have the honour of speaking to Ku the Colourful, maker of fireworks and dyes without equal, and leader of the Brewers Guild. Oh, nice. Ku the Colourful can see you are here to join the Brewers Guild. Don't answer, Ku can see it in your eyes. To begin your journey is easy, to complete it, not so easy. First, bring me four psyllium flower and four blueberry. Ku the Colourful is finished. Four psyllium flower and four blueberry. Okay. Can I just buy that here? I hope so. Hi. Hey there, Wayfarer. As you're not from around here, you might be able to so help me. I so need help growing a beard. I know it sounds a little unusual. Everyone in the village thinks I'm so crazy. You see, Boone the Beautiful has the most magnificent beard you've ever seen. I so want a beard like his. And I know how to grow it. Macy's friend's cousin's neighbor said that you need a ghost fish stew to grow a beard. The stew is made from ghost fish, which is caught in freshwater lakes and rivers around midnight. Oh, you don't eat it. You spread it where you want the hair to grow. That is so cool. I catch one myself, but I'm so afraid of lakes and rivers. Anything bigger than a bathtub makes me freak out. Here's a recipe for ghost fish stew. You can keep it. And please bring me the stew at night. Just like the fish, the stew is most potent at night. Fucking Jesus. Can I avoid talking to you from now on? I don't really want to talk to you again. Alright, looks like there's a shop up here somewhere. Another person to talk to. I didn't even see you on the map. Ah. Hey there, feel free to grab a warm drink. It can get cold here. I don't remember what happened after the lightning hit the boat. The brewers found me and took me in. It's amazing here, actually. They work hard, but they do love to unwind and have fun. Except Koo the Colourful, but he means well. It's great to hear that Captain Pullard is looking for us. Please tell him I'm very happy. And drop by any time you need to relax. We found Luff the Sailor. Sweet. That's a good start. I wasn't even looking for you. Well, I mean, sort of, but not really. Okay, I need four of you, and four of you. How much is that? 200 bucks? Dude! Oh, you sell fucking seeds! Ooh! Ooh! I'm gonna load up on them then. I need these. Coral bloom seed? Wait, didn't I need, um, dye or something? Blue dye or some shit like that? I don't know. Alright, we need to trade stuff for this. 214 bucks. If I trade the egg, I'm gonna need a lot of change. God damn. I could just buy everything he's got, I suppose. I suppose that's the thing I could do. But otherwise, I don't really know what to trade to him. We made the tree plot. I guess we don't need that. Yeah, I suppose that'll do. I'm gonna buy the water. Water's pretty handy. And buy up all the seeds. They're quite cheap anyway. And what else do we need? Is that glue? I'll have the glue. Because I can. Clay pot? I don't need that. Celium seed? Nah. Gold leaf? I don't know. I just want to make the value up, right? Take both those. That'll do. Whatever. You're getting a good deal out of this, my friend. A good deal indeed. Best be fucking happy. Ku the Colourful can see from your face that you have everything. Now take this clay pot and recipes for blue dye and brewer's kit. Come back when you've made a blue dye. Okay. We can do that. Blue dye. Okay. Done. We need oil and we can make the fiery boom water. Who the colourful doesn't think you're finished. Did I not did I not do it? Thought I did it. Asshole. Is it that one? A little colour goes a long way? I have to make two blue dough. Well that sucks. I was hoping to keep the the rest. Now I'm all out of bullshit again. Now take this recipe for blue firework and have some fun. When you've let off the firework, come talk to me. Okay. Guess you're gonna make a blue firework. We need a clay pot and a psyllium seed. Fuck's sakes. Dude, 
Give me the run around and shit. Why didn't you just tell me to get that shit to begin with? And the clay pot and psyllium seed. Stat. And oil. I need an oil too. I'm not happy about it though. This guy's giving me the fucking run around. Like I'm some kind of big knob. I'm gonna take that psyllium flower too. Probably gonna need that. Probably gonna need it. Okay, what are we gonna sell back to him? We can sell back shit that we picked up. We'll sell him that cloth. Then we're good. Basically, even Stevens at that point. I'll take a vine. Just to try and make the value up. Alright, let's make this firework, shall we? Boom. Now how do we let it off? Away! Holy crap! I did it under a bridge! Mistake! Run! Take cover! <laughs> Holy shit. Probably shouldn't have done that under the bridge. I <laughs> didn't notice. I we should have done that in an open space. Yeah. Ah, behold the wonders of the Brewers Guild. Brewers Guild novice badge. Perfect, just what I always wanted. Alright. Now we, oh, we need to make that boom water, or bloom water, whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, what do we need for that now? You see a Brewers kit? Sweet! That'll light the way to Arcadia, right? Cool. Alright. So that's gonna point us in the right direction. We have the bloom water, boom water, whatever the fuck it's called. We should be gravy train. We should be good to GO. It looks like this isn't the way we're going though. All the recipes are belong to me. Oh, Sprite! <gasps> Dude! Yeah. This twinkle light is warm and bright, but with you I will travel, seeker of the Sprite. Very rhymey, well done. Two more to find in the area. There's an exclamation mark behind me. There's a few around that are just like there, but I can't get to them anyway. I don't know how you deal with them. I don't know how to. Oh well. Ah, I see. It's that thing. Well, I'll come back to you in a second because there's a um, question mark over this way. I want to check that out. What is this? Is that like gold leaf? You just picked that, huh? What are you? <laughs> Fluff cub. You're a bear dog crossbreed thing. Cool. I think that is gold leaf. Maybe the exclamation mark's up here. Can I get up here without falling into the town? Oh, maybe that's a way down onto that bit. I mean, it is a way down onto that bit, but... Is that something I want to be doing? I'm not sure that it is. But I'm also not sure that it isn't. Alright, let's see what this merc down here has got for us. If we can bust it open. Woof woof. Ah, oh, it's another bridge, is it? Let's find out. You about to find out. And throw some hands. Fool. Oh, fuck, another stone bridge. Jesus Christ, they're fucking impossible to make. I've never even made one. There must be an easier way to do this. Alright, anyway, anyway. Let's head back. We're gonna drop this boom water. Onto this dearly and we'll see what that does, where Arcadia is or what it is or whatever is going to happen. Let's just do it. Okay. That looks mildly threatening. Follow the fire beam. Fire beam! Okay, looks like it's that one up there. How do we get to that one? Hmm.
Can I can I get to you? Oh, I see. Bust this shit out. Wait. There we go. That's better. That way. You got it. This is fun. <laughs> fun and lots of cool shenanigans to happen up in here. This is a great place. Shenanigans, I say. This way. I said door I couldn't open. Hmm. Is that gonna open the door? Totally is. Badass. Let's see what's in here. I hear kitty. Yeah, that's death down there. That's not kitty. That's dead. This must be up there. I'll be back. I hear a kitty. I have to deal with this first. This must be dealt with immediately. Yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Is that you? Fuck, they blend in so well and they're so tiny. Boom. I wonder how close we are to having all the kitties yet. Yay! Fuck off! Whoa. Okay, this place is trippy as. What the fuck is this? I don't even know what we're doing here. Hang on. We haven't even got the right mission on. Activate pillars to find Arcadian door. We're looking for Arcadian ice. Okay. Well, if we're lucky, at this rate we're going to have the fucking thing fixed and we're not even going to have like a f any farms up and running properly yet. Or we'll be able to craft anything. Or even finish the missions for half the fucking guilds to actually become fully fledged members of the guilds. That's pretty fucking lame. I should probably try a little bit harder. Just find something easy to craft and make it over and over and over again. That was that was my plan to begin with. Hello. Oh hey, it's a human. Are you trying to get a piece of Arcadian ice? Good luck. I'm not sure you'll get to the Arcadian ice with all those ice shards around it. Although, now you mention it, humans did figure out a way a long time ago. Not sure how they did it. All I remember is my ears ringing. You have to like play a musical note or something to shatter it. I don't even know. Firework? No? Well, it was great fun to watch, but it didn't really work. Maybe I just have to break all those. Maybe? Ooh, fancy. Aha! Go! Well, that seems dangerous in the cave made out of ice. I feel like that's taken my own life into my own hands pretty fucking hard right there. It's gonna ring a huge bell in the middle of a and while I'm underground in a cave made out of ice. Fantastic idea. But you did it, you're the greatest. Nice work getting rid of the ice crystals. It should be easy to grab a piece of Arcadian ice now. I forgot how you humans collect the Arcadian ice, but now it's ringing a bell. Ah, let me tell you a secret. I prefer warmer weather. Do you mind if I travel with you? Nice, so we got a, a, a new sprite and Arcadian Ice. Well, that was a good score. Totally worth the trip. Badassery. Oh, we're being so productive at the moment. It's so nice, but it also means it's probably not going to last. <laughs> How do I get out of this place? Let me out. I don't like it down here. The place could collapse on my head any minute. This way? Yeah, this way looks good. 
This way looks tasty, James. I just need to find mortar, and then I can... If I know how to make mortar, I can start making these stone bridges. But without the ability to make mortar, or know where to get mortar efficiently, it ain't gonna work. It just ain't gonna work. So, I don't know. I don't know. We got missions coming out of our fucking ears. Like, holy balls. Um, Master Taylor, Celestial... We've got the Celestial Ore, don't we? Oh, we're waiting three nights, that's right. Prepare the Cloud Catcher. So we need the Master Taylor, that's gonna make the, um... The sails, presumably. So that, that'll be nice. That, that'll be tasty jams. Let's see if we can break this. Fucking treasure chest! Traps and ingots. Sweet. That was good. That was great, actually. Uh, I might try and do the thousand dollars worth of brewing bullshit before I head out, but I'll do it off camera and I'll come back when I've got enough, which will be at the start of the next episode because we're out of time for this one. So I'll just stand down here and make the same thing over and over again until I've got that mission done. And then when we start the next episode, hopefully, we'll be able to get the master badge for it. Have I talked to you? What are you doing? Oh, oh gosh, it's you again. So what do you oh. think? This is one of my cute marts that you'll see located around Gamea. I'm bringing gruffle themed fashion to the masses. Thank you so much for your help. And remember, at Cute Mart, we turn drab into fab. The CEO of Cute Co. What do you do? You look like you're in a very precarious position. You could easily just flop into the water and die. Can I try these on before I, like, decide? Because, uh... Some of these look pretty cool, but I don't know until they're on me, you know? You know? I don't know. I'm not... I'm not convinced. Sorry. That shirt looked pretty cool, though. And yeah, so we just got this mission to do, which we will do in between episodes. I'll bring you back for the end of it, and then we'll head out to look for the Master Taylor. But for now, we're going to leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you in the next one.